I mean, I don't know. I, I, I obviously I really wanted to pay my respects to uh, Muhammad Ali. Um, never had a chance to kind of meet him. I was kind of young when he was doing his tours and going around the world and all that stuff. He actually, I'm originally from Iran. He came to Iran twice. But um, so he was, you know, growing up, I always knew about him. Um, and uh, we sort of, well, he was famous for his boxing and he converted to Islam and, you know, a lot of things. But then when I moved to States, I also found out more about him as far as his, you know, civil rights movement and well, he was a superstar, right? He was, he, was a, he was this young man and he just, you know, was really good and he was a champion of the world and he had the, the characteristic, he had the character. Um, so, yeah, he was just super popular. My dad used to, like, wake up at 2 a.m. in the morning to watch his fights because all the fights were usually aired because of the time difference. It was, like, at midnight. So it was an event, you know, it was just... So that's that's how we grew up watching him, so... The, the body is buried uh, not in a coffin, in, in, a, in a shroud, in a cotton shroud. So then the idea is you kind of kind of belong to the earth and you kind of decompose. And then once um, after uh, you have a certain amount of time for, and they wait for the ground to settle or something like that, um, before putting the, uh, the headstone on.